In this short video, I'm going to be showing you how to enable taps and touches when screen recording on your Android device. For this video, I'm using a Samsung S23, so please keep that in mind because the process we're about to show you might be a little bit different depending on the type of Android device they're using. I'm also going to be using an integrated uh, screen recorder on my uh, Samsung device. I'm not going to be using any alternatives um, like applications from the Play Store or anything like that. So keep that in mind as well. Now what you want to do is simply head over to your settings and then click on the advanced features uh, button which is about halfway down. Click on that and then you want to look for the screenshots and screen recorder setting which is right here. Now if you can't find a particular setting what you can do is simply head back to your settings and just search for it using the magnifying glass or the other alternative is to just scroll down from the top of your screen and then look for the screen recorder shortcut. In my case, it's on the second page in the top right corner and just hold on top of it. And this will take you to this exact page. From here, what you want to do is scroll all the way down and under the screen recorder, you will see short taps and touches. In my case, it's already enabled. And as you can see, it's kind of grayed out right now because I am using the screen recorder. So I can't change any of the settings while recording this video. But uh, if that setting is disabled, simply enable it and taps and touches are going to be showing whenever you screen record on your Android device. And yeah, that's pretty much everything to know uh, about this topic. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments below and I'll be more than happy to help.